Okay, so we're going to start with simplifying fractions. First step is finding factors that are divisible to the numerator and the denominator, or factors that can go into. And then we're going to, the second step is finding the like uh, terms or the like factors once you find them. So eight sevens, factors that are divisible. Step one, what goes into eight? Uh, we have one, two, four, and eight. Eight times one is eight. Two times four is eight. And likewise, four times two is eight. What are What is divisible into seven or what can go into seven uh, is one and seven. Seven times one is seven. S step two, do we have any like terms in the in the numerator and denominator. We see that we do not have any except for ones. And if we do, if we divide by one, it's only gonna bring us back to the original uh, answer or the equation. And in this case, eight sevenths is not simplified or it's in, it's in a simplified form. Next one, we're gonna go to four twelfths. <clears throat> what can be, uh, what factors can go into four? What factors can go into 12? Let's see. We have one, two, and four. Four times one is four. Two times two is four. And we have four here. What goes into 12 is one, two, three, four, six, and 12. 12 times one is 12. Six times two is 12. And three times four and four times three is 12. Step two, we need to find like terms between the numerator and the, num and the denominator. We have four and four. We could use one and one and two and two, but we'll just end up having to simplify in double steps. So let's just use four and four. Now we have to, to, have to divide our like terms. Four divided by four, this is step three. 4 divided by 4 is 1. 12 divided by 4 is 3. <clears throat> Breaking this down even fur further, we have 4 divided by 12. And we check our division with multiplication. Likewise, we check our multiplication with division. 4 divided by 12, how much can this go in? So 4 times what equals 1? Nothing. So now we got four times, ah, come on, come on. Zero times four equals uh, zero. Now we still got 12. So we know time tables, four times one is uh, four, four times two is eight, four times three is 12. So we have 12, three here, because three times four equals 12. And here we are, simplification.